Sweet victory, y'all. Finally, okay? Kappa has been fucking me up recently, but I got a fix. So, I contacted YouTube, and basically, they did talk to me about the Kappa Act. Um, oh my god, the hoodie is so... You can look at my hoodie, the, it's getting worse. It's no longer black. It's now violet. I have to take the logo off, which I'll show you in a different video on how to do that. But, like, you see the hand there? See that beautiful hand? You see this chair? Um, the candlestick is in, but, like, today we're going to use this as an example. Today, we're going to make barbed wire. Barbed wire is a great, great item. It's a great thing in notches, and most people will need it. So, I'm going to teach you how to make it. So, you're going to need this. You may be asking yourself. You can get silver wires, like floral wire, which is way better than this, I'm going to say. Just do the same method. I don't have floral wire. I don't have silver wire at all. Um, but I think this would work. So honestly, let's just, um, let's get started. I do have a canker sore, so sorry. We have scissors over here for, um, the little parts in the barbed wire. So basically, you're gonna have to get a long, long, a long boy. We're gonna get a long boy for now. Not really that long. You can grab your scissors, but if you don't have scissors, you have this thing. You can do this, and you can just push it like you can go deep deep to the end and then cut that's how you cut it if you have stuff like this totally recommend it you don't need scissors however I recommend it a lot okay next step you're going to know uh, this is an extra step if you guys guys already have like silver stuff then this is gonna be okay. be careful if you guys are kids uh, ask your mom and dad for permission if I can focus this in camera right now right now okay you can see this thing you have to cut Now, why am I doing this? There's actually a reason. If I do this and then go back here and go back over, you can see that there's like a white thing over here. That white thing is something we're going to need the most. So we're going to have to scrape off that. See this thing? So then you're gonna... If you have like, um, there are specific tools. I think there's like wire cutters and stuff. Um, there are some tools. Pliers can definitely take off these white things. Again, I'm telling you now. Ask your mom or dad permission to do this, or show the video at least. Show the video to their mom or send the link so that I can get better views. As you can see over here. We got a decent line. It doesn't have to be straight. Again, we're going to bend it anyways. So, yeah. Um, now, you got it. You might want to cut. Okay. You're going to do it again. So, I'm just going to skip over that part. Okay. Now, I got it. Okay. So, we're going to take this as an extra. If you guys have white, you may use this for Spider-Man webbing if you really want to. But no, today is a wrestling figure video. So, I'm going to close up this thing. This is important. So, if you guys want to go more in-depth, you can do this. Okay. Um, if you have a very long strap, which I actually do have. Okay, so since I'm going to have to zoom this off, because this is very long. Okay. Find the ends of these two wires. Okay, find these. Um, we're going to come back in a little bit more. We're going to make this go in focus. Good. Okay, now you're going to need these two wires to meet to the end. Gotta straighten this out. Make sure it's not too bend. Uh, I'm just gonna this. Okay. Now you're gonna leave this cross, right? And you do is twist. Keep twisting. If you don't mess up, you're gonna get something that looks like this, which is what you're gonna want. 
This is does not appear in. I don't think. I think this does appear in real life um, barbed wire. You might fuck up like that, so best to pull off and then like untangle it for a bit, which will take a very long time, by the way. There, like you're gonna need to take a lot of time to master this. So I'll just show you when I'm done. Okay, after an epic fail, this is all I can do, but this is actually nice. If you wanna use this, you can make it like a chain mill if you want. I would just cool. Now what you need to keep it like this. This is nice. If you have something to hold it onto, like if you want to hold on to a kendo stick, it's just something you're gonna wanna do by the way. To hold it very standing up still, like you have to make it stand up. But you know, okay, now that you've done this, you may be asking yourself, Zach, that's cool. What what about the next step? So grab your other wire, the wire that you still have, the short wire. Uh, the short wires that I had in the previous part. I don't want to wrap it around. Cool. Nice. And it's supposed to look exactly like this. So what you gotta do, grab your scissors and cut. Again, I'm telling you now, don't do this unless you have your parents. If you're kids, if you're adults that are dumb, still ask for your parents. If they're in a grave, then, you know, just be safe. Wear gloves, like, outside as well. So look at this niceness. You can see the niceness of the barbed wire. It's not bad. It's not good either. Like, I've made way better ones in the past. But, like, this can be a good example. You're going to keep doing this, um, but not too much. You have to go, like, at least a couple, um, like, a, um, like, half an inch farther away every time so like you're gonna do that and you're gonna keep rolling when you keep rolling you'll get this thing and then snip and bada boom that's cool you got it you guys are done so pretty much um that can be your barbed wire or if you guys want to skip the thing that i showed you a while ago that it will be completely fine you can just go straight on with the wire go do this do the technique i showed you the spin 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 i recommend five times at least or like two at minimum maximum at least four to five which will be important get that shit good go cut what shall now looks really cool you're gonna keep doing this again as i showed you a while ago and bada boom you did it you finally got that Nice is oh yeah, this is also the penalty. You get some germs on your hands. Um a fair note from Zach the Saint, wash your fucking hands. Okay, the coronavirus is big, so wash your hands. Now you can wrap it on to a kendo stick and give your baby you can give your best friends the everlasting ass whooping. Nice. So yeah, that's pretty much a very, very um it's not uh it's more informative. Um, you might have seen MDT Live's video, My Damn Toys' video about doing barbed wire. He just went straight on with the wire. I went more in depth, but if you kind of like it, it looks super nice. If you wanna, if you wanna do, if you wanna see tutorials like this again, I know you may be asking. You've been, you have stopped doing this for like what two weeks? Um, what happened then? Well, um, basically, I already told you in the beginning. YouTube already emailed me based on Kappa and they said I was okay as long as I did not show my face in videos like this so yeah but thank you guys for watching comment like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video goodbye okay after making that video I need to talk first about the Moxley hoodie for a sec um so the Moxley hoodie apparently is broken the fabric broke itself. The fabric broke because the logo was actually seeping in the hoodie. It was seeping. The logo paper, the paper of the logo got inside the, the fabric itself. So basically what it was doing in, in itself, it was making the fabric thinner so it got easy to tear. So basically what I did was I just printed the logo off and I kind of stuck it on there. Um, yeah. 
I think this will be a temporary fix. I'll get another one anyways. And Ginati, if you're watching this video, um, I DM'd you on Instagram telling you about what happened. I bought this in April or May, I forgot, and it just started breaking away, started deteriorating the fabric. Even the threads on the arms, the sleeves broke, but um, I fixed it up because my mom had the sewing machine. But like, yeah, anyways, if you guys are wanting to buy stuff like this, uh, Ginati is up in line, online. I don't think he sells these anymore, but um, if we do have to run into the same problem, then um, it's best to just print another logo off and paste it on here. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. I want you guys to comment, like, and subscribe, and I will actually see you guys in another video. Goodbye!